Hello and welcome to the John Ark Show. Today's episode is called, Has Your Pension Already Been Stolen? Before we begin, I want to encourage you to subscribe to our channel for free. You can also like, comment, and follow us. Make sure to send a link of this show to all your friends and post it on your social media to spread the word. We're going to have a lot of great celebrity interviews coming up, so make sure to click on that notification bell so you can be notified every time we upload a new episode. Now, let's get started. Here's a question that everyone should be asking themselves. Has your pension already been stolen? Many people know or suspect that some or all of their pension fund money has been misappropriated, drained off, or outright stolen. But most people don't know the way it was stolen or how much of their pension has already been taken. There are several ways that pensions are being diminished or stolen. The first and most popular is accounting fraud. Now, what's interesting is how many pensions around the U.S. are suddenly coming up short and very little is being said about why it's coming up short. Most of the pension managers will claim their investment in the market took a beating and that's what's causing their shortfalls. But it's, uh, it's interesting how the misrepresentation and the, uh, the shrinkage continues even when there is a strong market. How is this fraud concealed? Well, one trick that many companies who've uh, been raiding their pensions will do is they will try and sell part or all of their company to a prospective buyer with the understanding that the buyer will have to make up the pension shortfalls or losses as part of the purchase price of that company. Now, one of the really big problems with pension audits is that they mean nothing. They mean less than nothing. Any CEO can hire an accounting agency and pressure them into certifying the results of a meaningless audit that will confirm everything is just a-okay. There's nothing to see here. Look away. The pension money's there. Trust us. Accounting firm uh, audits have almost zero value. Everybody knows that. At a certain level, almost everyone knows that. That's because they can be bought and paid for. Just like you can purchase an award for your movie or your latest album or TV show. Just like you can purchase a not guilty verdict with the right judge or jury or lawyers. Just like you can purchase a pardon for your favorite criminal. Just like you can purchase a crate full of stolen kidneys for your hospital chain if you need some extra money for the upcoming quarter in order to qualify for that big bonus you were hoping for. Sounds preposterous, doesn't it? So the question becomes, what can you do to protect your pension if you feel it may be stolen? Well, that depends on who your pension is with. If you worked for a Fortune 1000 company that you think may be ripping you off, then you may want to join forces uh, online with uh, many of your other former employees of the same company and then band together to hire a lawyer and get a court order to conduct a forensic audit of that pension. The key here is to have the forensic audit conducted by a firm that has never done business uh, with your former employer because they would uh, exert undue influence on that audit. Trust me. One of the advantages of banding together as a larger group of pensioners is that you can split the cost of the audit and as a large group, you'll even be more likely to get the attention of the media, of the press. Just make sure the reporters you go to don't work for a company that is actually owned by the conglomerate you used to work for. That probably wouldn't work too well for you. Another thing you should all do is use a free service called Google Alerts that will help you monitor any news stories about your former employer or their pension funds. Remember, the louder your former employer screams that there's nothing wrong with the pension, the more concerned you should be. A lot of these pensions have been robbed and the only thing keeping them going is more accounting fraud stacked on top of old accounting fraud. (laughs) So stay alert, stay vigilant, and do your research. Thank you for watching. I want to encourage you to subscribe to our channel for free. You can also like, comment, and follow us. We're going to have a lot of great celebrity interviews coming up, so make sure to uh, click on that notification bell so you can be notified uh, every time we post a new episode. And make sure to send a link to this episode to all your friends and post it on everybody's social media. We'd appreciate it. 
Thank you very much, and we shall see you soon. Goodbye.